What's going on guys, Drastic Scuba here and welcome to our playthrough of Wolong Fallen Dynasty. I've been looking forward to this one for a while and I'm dying to jump into it, so let's see what this game has to offer. Okay, so first of all, I am gonna disable motion blur. Um, I could enable HDR, but I find that sometimes when I enable HDR it can really mess up the um, the Elgato's picking up of the gameplay, so I don't want to mess up like the colours on the gameplay if I can help it. But yeah, motion blur, I ain't interested, I hate motion blur in games for the most part. Okay, and new game, we are on version 1.02, this is the 3rd of March, and it is 4 minutes past 7 in Beijing time. So, I'm saying Beijing time because I live in China, so it's just easier for me. Right, let's get to it. So it's quite nice to be playing um, a game that's got this sort of setting, considering that I live in China, so yeah, that would be great. I'm deliberately letting you see how long the loading screen is, to see how long it takes to fire up. Okay, here we go. I will silence my mic during this cutscene, and I'll leave a timestamp in the screen Elixir, if you want to skip it. The secret of the eternal path, a prize sought by the sovereigns of old. Among them was the first emperor of the Qin, who lusted for immortality. The result of his quest to obtain the forbidden medicine was a catastrophe. The elixir's power proved overwhelming. And in the years following the dynasty's demise, it continued to exert a shadowy influence on conflict and political machinations. Many moons pass, and the Han Empire faces its final days. In these dark times, Elixir once again threatens to become the catalyst that awakens the dragons lying dormant across our land. I'm interested to see how they handle dragons, because dragons to Chinese people are considered to be benevolent creatures. We'll see how this game handles Bear it. Witness to the power of your younger brother. The world shall soon bask in the majesty of the yellow heaven. Bring prosperity for all. Bring prosperity for all. I'm noticing the colours were a little bit off already, so I'm just messing around with the contrast me. right now. I'm glad you've recovered from your injuries. Yeah, he looks a little bit better. I found you, bearer of the eternal elixir field. Okay, time to create our character. Let me <clears throat> move myself. Oh, that is not me. That is that. Okay, so we'll tuck ourselves down here so I'm not in the way. Um, 
Okay, give me a second. I'm going to mess about with the uh, visual settings a little bit more. Okay, I hope that looks a little bit better. Um, yeah, the colors and stuff just seemed a little bit off there, but we're good to go. Let's go base, figure unselected. We have type 1. And type 2. So it's basically just male physique or female physique. Appearance template. Oh, no, I want to be type 1. Appearance template. So how we start? How many have we got? Okay, so we got pretty much just, uh, what is his name? William from Neo. This is the developers of Neo, I think. Yeah, it is. I'm pretty sure it is. Um, so makes sense to put a character like him in there. Um, let's see what else we have. Standard samurai look. This one's not too bad, too. Yeah, I think we'll kick on this one. Okay. Personal pronouns. This is why I said physique, because I saw the pronouns down here. Okay, stance. What, what are we doing with stance here? Is it the way he, like, twists his arms? Oh, yeah, right, he's twisting his feet and stuff, yeah. Uh, yeah, we'll just keep on what it was on. Skin color is fine. I'm already quite happy with it. The skin type. I basically, when I choose a skin type, I usually just want one that has, like, quite nice detail and looks more realistic. This one looks kind of pasty. Um, so I don't usually choose those pasty looking ones. So I'll choose the first one. Body skin type. It's basically just scarred or not, so I'll just chuck on it. No, well, I mean, yeah, yeah, I'll put, I'll put it on. It's, it adds character. It adds a little bit of character to him. Okay, next part, face. I think we're pretty much, we're not going to mess about with like the shape of each thing and stuff, but I'm going to go and just let people kind of see what the options are a little bit. It's like you've got smile lines and stuff, but I'm not going to change a bunch of stuff. Um, you can change your eyebrow type, sure. Choose a random one that doesn't look ridiculous. Yeah, sounds great. Uh, eyes, um, eye type, yeah, just different. Shapes and openness. Yeah. Now I'm fine with what I have. Do we change our eye color here now? Even though our eyes are blue, I'll probably just do blue anyway. Iris. There you go. Uh, so you change your color based on presets, or you can make a custom color. Um, but it's already blue. My eyes are blue, so nothing to change there. Nose. I'm not going to mess with it. It looks fine. I will mess it up. Do we have teeth? Or is it just presets? Yeah. Uh, it doesn't look like there's any teeth option. Okay. Uh, face decoration, so you can, oh, there you go, you can choose some stars, or little tattoos, or markings. Um, but again, I'm not going to add anything like that, but it's there, you can have up to three of them. Are they the same? Yeah, they look the same. Face accessory. Oh, you can do this if you're, I don't know, if you need to stick your address to your head when you're drunk. Okay, so, got some accessories. I'd actually be a pretty cool one about pretending to be blind but not really ear accessory i guess just earrings yep okay great so that's those options and now we just got hair um i think the hair was okay might see something cooler but that's just the william look. I, I wanted like try and avoid the william look so i think i'm just gonna keep this one yeah it's fine but we will give him some facial hair we need to be a man your man just about stubble there we go uh, makeup, I believe we will avoid. Oh, there you go, teeth blackening. So yeah, you can actually change the teeth. That's a nice touch. You can have sharper canines or well, not canines, uh, incisors or nah. Oh no, is the canines that are changing? Never mind. Okay. Uh, yeah, sweet. And you get some face paint as well if you want to paint your face. I didn't mean to do that. Oh my god, I did. I did not mean to do that. Uh, apply face paint. No, thank God. <laughs> I didn't realize it was just a checkbox. Uh, height, we'll give him a little bit more height. Head size, neck length. Fuck, a bit more neck length. Sure, there we go. Muscle definition. Uh, I'm actually of a look where... Give him a little bit of torso. Bring down the arms slightly. Yeah, there we go. I'll do. Chest size, up to. Body accessory. Again, scars. Uh, you can choose the part of the body. We can have up to three of those. Okay, voice. Let's listen. Okay. 
Okay, so no voice. Sure, why not? Yeah, I'll do. And finalize, we're ready to go. Yes, I don't want to change it. Yeah, I think it just said you can change your appearance later in the game. Or it said the opposite. I uh, just took a quick glance. Finally. After all this time. My wish has been fulfilled. Now you're gonna have to pay for it, mate. As long as we have you, victory is still possible. Consider that a talisman of protection. It may just save your life one day. I cannot allow this travesty to continue. Let us depart. I don't know how the UI is set up in this game, so I don't even know where we'll be best from a camera until the gameplay actually begins. So my face might change location depending on the UI. But right now it seems okay. Um, so take this. I'm not covering I'm sure anything right now. Still. There's nothing behind it's a medicine me. Created from refined chair. Not anything With in the it, game. You can heal most wounds. Okay. Cool. Right. Um, let's see, we have light attack, I imagine. Heavy attack. Mm -hmm. Got some flip thing. Dodge. How much dodging can we... Oh, what? Okay, I think it was just... Yeah, okay. Okay. Um... So it's like guard. Can we do anything while guarding? Oh, hello. Uh, is this a special attack? Hello. Cool. Right, I think we are good to go. Enemy over here. Normal attack, spirit attack. It's a spirit attack, okay. Normal attacks are fast and can easily increase your spirit. Spirit attacks are slower but deal more spirit damage, which can reduce the enemy spirit gauge. Furthermore, when you have possible spirit, you can consume the surplus spirit to increase it. Oh my god. <laughs> to increase... Uh, I lost where I was now. To increase damage. You will also not fall during attacks and will penetrate enemy's guard. Let's see the video. Light, light, light. And spirit. Hmm. Okay. So we just did it like that. Yeah, I mean, clearly your trust is easily gained. Okay, right triggers to loot. A genuine chi flick. I will pronounce that word chi and not chi. I will pronounce it properly. Yeah, that's okay. I'm picking stuff up, mate, but thank you. Oh, he's got to be one of those guys. Is it? Oh, right, okay. There's a... So, I think that's what it is. Oh, no, it's, no, he really does just climb fast. Okay, now. Let's go. Yo. I missed. Okay, so that's a thing. Right, lock on. I think I need it. Damn, son. Right, that's one down. Okay, so what happens with our health? I know he said something about healing, but, um, so what did I do? Is it a D-pad, I imagine? Down, up, up. So I press up on a D-pad. Oh, and that's what I'm covering with my head. So I am gonna make myself scarce and put myself up here. Seems fine. And I will adjust accordingly. So that I can tuck myself in a little bit further by this. There we go. Seems nice. It's all on the fly, guys. It's all on the fly. Deflect B and left stick of B right before it's received to deflect. Dodge is BB or 
Using B will allow you to redirect. Okay, so I think it's just gonna take a little bit of practice, but let's see. Okay, that worked. Gotcha. Okay, I get it. Yeah, so this one is like a par. It's like a weird parry mechanic. You have to double tap B. Yep, that's how it works. Easy enough. So far. Don't want to miss the loot. Don't want to miss the loot. If we lower that, it might serve as a platform. Platform. Platform to where? Just back up. But why would I need to go back up here? Okay. Right, let's continue and see where this path takes us. Genuine sea flake. Okay. Oh, no, no, no. No, 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 no. That is not the way. Hmm. Okay. Bro, any ideas? I thought that red thing on the compass was like, just tell me exactly where to go, but uh, see it's probably not quite that simple. Up here? That's an attack. Okay. There we go. We could have all the morale in the world, but he's dead. So is that our morale as well? The two down there? Must be our morale too. I don't know how the morale works though. This was the village elder's residence. This is barbaric. This is profitable. Polarm Podal or Podal. Uh, let's see, equipment. So if we... What do we have? Uh, okay. And I change with... This. Right trigger. Uh, let's try our Polarm then. Deflect against enemy's critical blow. An enemy will wind up to perform a critical blow which cannot be blocked with guard. Taking damage from it will lower your morale by one. If you redirect it, the power of the deflect increases and you can significantly break the enemy stance and recover your negative spirit. Okay, so I did that a little bit too early there. Wow, that damage. Nice. Yellow Turban Bandit Guard. How does that compare? That is not what I'm looking for. Uh, I'm looking for uh, equipment again. Armor. Is it better or worse? Something's better. But, nah, we'll keep what we've got. Keep, keep what we've got. At re after resting at a battle flag, your HP and use of the dragon cure pot will be increased. Right, just Dark Souls basically. Very, very standard for anyone that plays these types of games. Hey, got an achievement. Happy days. Do they give us artwork for an achievement? Nah, they just give stupid logos, just like a lot of games do. So lazy, come on. Xbox allows for art. Loving it, that was cool. Like it. Heat proof ice. Okay. Get up here? Yes. Oh, what's that? Another flag? Or oh, it's just a marking flag. Don't know what that does. We shall have to find another way around. Yellow turban bandit footwear. From the rear above. Like this? Yeah, there we go. Oh, nice. So far, I'm liking the feel of the polearm quite a bit. It feels good. Oh, 
What's the? I'm going to see my attack with the poor man. Well, I'm not, because he's just interrupted it. Oh, damn, son. Yes. Uh, I wanted this, so that's what I... What I it's a very slow attack from the poor man. But it must have a lot of damage then. But that's cool, kills, kills, kill. We're still learning. Is this it's just a marking flag and I pressed the wrong button. Um Fortitude rank increased again. Okay, so Did I miss any loot? I don't think I did. Let's try this way. Well, good luck to you, sir. Um, does doing that count as resting? I'm not sure. Hold that again. Let's have a look. Level up. Genuine chi. Required genuine chi. Uh, affects HP and amount of spirit lost. Fire virtue aff amount affects amount of spirit gain when attacking and amount of spirit consumed by martial arts. Earth virtue affects the equipment weight limit and amount of spirit gain when deflecting an attack. That sounds pretty good. Pretty good. Metal virtue affects the duration that a high level of spirit can be maintained and the spirit consumed by wizardry spells. Water virtue affects how easily enemies can detect you. So you can like go for a like little sneaky stealth build. Maybe play like sneak in, kill, sneak back out type of thing. An amount of spirit consumed with deflecting. Ah, so deflecting does your spirit. So I'm thinking I want a little bit of earth, a little bit of water. I'm curious to see, is it based on my level? Or is it based on the level of the virtue, how much chi is spent? So I'm going to invest in this one. Yeah, so it's based on your level. Um, You need more. So have I got enough? Yeah, so I'm going to get one in water and one in earth. That's what I'm going to do right now. Okay. Excellent. The following feature has been unlocked. Wizardry spells. Let's have a look. Uh, what do we use to learn them? So where do we start? I'm guessing we start from here. Calls down a bolt of lightning on a locked on target. Uh, that sounds good. Can I get this? Yeah. Sure. I don't even know what I spent to get it. Um, it, I can see that it says here um, that you need to have level 1 in the first thing, which thing we obviously have that. In this one you had to have level 2 and that's why I couldn't get this one. Oh, right. So I should have did this and went to the ones that I've been working on, like rock spinning stuff. But that's fine, actually. I think this one sounds good. Just a basic attack from... A certain distance, just, yeah, that sounds good. I don't regret getting it. Um, but let's have a look at the other ones. Uh, a blasting flare. Firebolt. Oh, that sounds well, that, that, that actually looks shocking. It sounded better. Summons rock pillars in front of you. Explode and knock away enemies. That also sounds good. Enhanced defense. Hmm. Wait, how many points do I have to spend? How many points do I have? Um, I'm gonna... Can I get this? Okay. Nice. Um, let's try setting them. Uh, let's do... I think my defense one on this here. And we'll do our attack one on our basic attack um, thing. And we cast them with right trigger. Yes. Yes. Go. Cool. I'm sure a person of your caliber shall have little difficulty mastering wizardry spells. I think he's correct. I think we'll be able to master these very, very easily. So let's move on. How have such uh, worldly things found their way here? I don't know. Try our lightning again. 
Okay, that's an okay amount of damage. Okay amount of damage. We've done well to get this far. But it's not over yet. Ah, yes. Once we rid this area of enemies, genuine chief like you able to stop by my house? There's something I wish to give you. Your house? You're gonna need to pay for that, mate. Eh, uh, do I go up here or do I go down here? Or is that a choice? But let's do this. Oh. Stay behind me, please. No. I don't need your help, okay? I can do it myself. Yellow Turpin Champion Armor. Now that might change the situation here. Oh, it's chill accumulation and stuff. But the actual basic resistances are worse than the bandit garb. Interesting indeed. Martial Arts 1, Martial Arts 2. I thought it was going to give me an opportunity to just cast that martial art, and that's why it was telling me to do it, but apparently not. You'll lose your morale points and half of your genuine kill. Only half your key? Okay. When you're killed by an enemy. Morale rank of the enemy that killed you will increase. You can regra regain your lost key and morale points by defeating the same enemy. The enemy is a boss, you'll regain them, regain them by challenging them once again. However, if you die before regaining them, they'll be lost forever. And then... You'll lose another half and another half and so on it goes. Okay, okay. So it's a little bit more forgiving than other Souls-like games, which... I, I, I actually, I, th I think that's a good thing. I think that's a good thing. That's actually one of the things that always put me off of Souls games, is just... The, like, being discouraged from trying the boss again because you don't want to lose your stuff. Like, or to try in a boss because you don't want to lose your stuff. Like, to, for, like, beginners. Obviously not for people that have got experience with the games. For newcomers, it might be a little bit daunting. There we are. Thank you. Okay, I'm going to go beat this guy up. And, like, it's going to be, like, it's going to be beautiful. Did I use his thing that time? Okay, then I'll use mine. Boom. Cast. Ha! This time I've reduced the damage. Sorry, mate. Give me my stuff. Great things. We shall find out soon enough. We won, indeed. I still can't believe I died, though. Dead. Crossbow guy? Or is it a bow and arrow guy? Let's see. Right, I need to be careful with my stamina posture thing here. Um, but so far we're looking alright. Not bad down there. Obviously we'll get better as we go on, as we always do. I did finish um, the first Neo um, game. And I'm getting similar vibes from this game to Neil. No doubt. No doubt. Okay. Give him some of that lightning life. Okay, we're out. Mate, I've overcompensated there. Oh, damn, son! <laughs> yeah, I need to get used to the um, the mechanic with the. I think I don't think it's posture. I think that bar that keeps kind of changing might be the spirit. I'll need to get used to it. So, yeah, it didn't it didn't feel like a difficult boss. I do it just it got me staggered. It's fair enough. So now I get used to this. Uh, mechanic. Okay. Easy peasy. Whack. 
Thank you. Over here. You got me, partner. Did lightning kill him? Nice! Killed him with lightning. Okay, let's take a drink. And... Do that. Run around here. You're dead. You're dead. I felt fairly clean. Okay. Right. I think I'm gonna start with a lightning strike. Now another lightning strike. Mm-hmm. Okay, now we were just damage. Hmm, interesting. I felt like we should have deflected that, but maybe my timing was just off. Whack. Ooh, nice. Right, there we go. There's the deflection. There is the deflection. Yellow turban champion footwear. That was good. That was good. Happy days. Uh, what's this? Another genuine chief lake. And we got a revenge. Put this down and we can get our stuff up again. I think I do want to aim to get everything at level 2 first, so I at least have access to the bottom spells. So let's have a look. Level up. And we will go for... Wood Witcher, yeah. And we have enough for one more, so should we do fire or metal? I think I'm gonna go for... I'm gonna go for metal. I'll go for metal. There we go. And we'll get fire next, and then we'll start focusing on the ones we want, which at first glance for me right now, it seems like water and earth would be nice. Um, yeah. We'll have a look at the lost stuff like deliveries and stuff later. I hope that everyone who escaped the brutality has gone to safety now. Mm. I sense a great danger ahead. Do be careful. Oh, boss time? Is it boss time? Oh, it's good we spent all our stuff. Right, let's go. Boss time. That guy with us is probably gonna get himself killed. Dogs of the Han Court, are you? I beat this guy in Dynasty Warriors many, hey, many times. Jung Young. Okay. Okay, so he, his attacks can be fairly comfortably interrupted. Got him again. Okay. Okay, that was a little bit more have to deal with. Oh, the lightning ain't working here. <laughs> right. I really, really really thought I deflected that. Um, I, yeah, I need to get better at the deflecting of the critical strikes because I really, really thought I did that, um, like, quite comfortably, so I must be misunderstanding it. Uh, okay, he doesn't seem too hard, to be honest. Um, I mean, his attacks can be interrupted and stuff, so 
And obviously we're not worried too much about getting our stuff back. We only lost 35, but we got it all spent. Do we need to go through cutscene again? Or no? Nah. You'll be begging me to spare you. Yeah. Hmm. Again, for a bit. I I tried to deflect that one. That's why I like stayed in range. I wanted to get it, but yeah, each attack must have a different like sort of way for deflecting. All right, drink this. Damn. Ooh. Behind you? Sure thing, man. Okay. I, again, I thought I deflected it. Um. And lightning doesn't interrupt it, which is good to know. It's good to learn this stuff. Um, but yeah, again, I thought I, um, I thought I deflected that. So yeah, again, I'm definitely not judging that timing correctly. Anything in here? Nah. Uh, maybe I could try a sword as well. See how that is. Yeah, maybe the speed will help, because it looks like I can still interrupt his attacks with a sword. Except that attack. Oh, but I got the block Garen at the to, so that's nice. Oh, so you, yeah, just put on the sword and just keep the pressure up. Oh, didn't see that coming. Or that coming. Oh my god. I drink. Yeah, I misjudged it again. I think I'm doing it too early. I think it's as it swings I need to dodge. Come on. Okay, get back. Nah, misjudge that. I really thought that was it. I, I can't really... I'm not working that one out properly. These ones I've got. We're fine. I think we're gonna win this one. Yeah, there we go. It's done, it's done, it's done. So yeah, you just had to keep the pressure on. The the pole arm was a bit slow. What is that power? I General of Man, brother of the great sage mentor! Oh wait. That wasn't the difficult part. I see. Okay. My brother's <laughs> trust. I knew he's gotta get himself messed up. Was this Resident Evil? What's going on here? Do I have some special magic too, like that? No? How so? 
Ah, uh, yeah, now it feels like a Dark Souls boss or something. Yeah, I'm not interrupting those attacks. Not in a million years. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not interrupting those. That's a completely different fight now. Um, we'll see what goes. We'll see what goes. Uh, will we, I hope it stays in that form. Uh, just for time reasons. Right, let's give it another go. No, it doesn't. Fuck. Um, literally, I'm just thinking as well, like, because of the time of the video, though, and the video will be super long, so... This might need to be the last attempt of this episode, so... Because that's just... Otherwise, it's just gonna be way too long. I'm not gonna upload a big, super long video. Right, just keep the pressure on. I still can't fucking block that one. Like, I don't know. I've tried all sorts of different timings for blocking that one, and nothing seems to work. At least on purpose. Yeah, uh... Quick notice, guys. I'm about to tell you that the episode is over, but it's not over because I beat him in my first try on the next video and it was really quick, so I've just added what I thought was going to be episode 2 to the end. So don't worry, I try one more time and I get it done. I'm going to try and beat him in the other episodes. Uh, the other episodes could be dedicated to this, isn't it? But there's no way that I'm um, making my, my videos already for over 40 minutes long, so... Yeah, if you want to see me eventually beat this guy, let's hope I do it in the next one. Thanks for watching, guys. What's going on, guys? Drastic Scuba here, and welcome back to Wolong Fallen Dynasty. Um, yeah, the last boss kicked my ass a couple of times, and I didn't want the last video to go on too long, so we're just going to continue, and who knows, maybe we'll beat him this time. Maybe we won't. We shall find out for sure. So first, I want to do this. And I may try the, um, this again. Okay, I got it that time. Oh, nice. Okay. Hey, there we go. I want to get through this stage without using any of my health stuff. Okay. It's a damage though, but, uh, but... Okay. Right, I'm gonna use a health potion because I don't actually know how much damage this does. I don't even know what attacks I can block, if any. Right. Okay. So it's like that, is it? Right. Yeah, block it. I've not been blocking enough. Ooh. Okay. Oh, I didn't get it. I thought I blocked that. Oh, my goodness. Okay, potion. Did I get it? I did. I think. Or did I? I don't know. Maybe I didn't. My god. Yes! We did the first time in the video! Yes! 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 
Right, <laughs> maybe I could have did it in the last video then. I don't know. Or maybe I did it because I took a breather. I waited for my recording to remix and stuff. Oh, that was so cool. So I've got Magical Beast. Huh? You fought very well. Now, the village is safe. By my head. Why are you? <laughs> you shall die! He belongs every bit as strong as the rumors say. What just happened? <laughs> I guess we're not going to that guy's house. They asked in the last video, can we stop by my house? Well, no. Unless you got money in there, I'll go back. Damn, man. Damn. Hmm. This world is steeped in chaos. It needs one like you to bring peace to it. I cannot let you die. How's he still around? Okay. S stubble looks kind of ginger, but that's okay. I will allow it. Now, you know what? I'm just going to trim that to the end, that part to the end of the last video. It was only five minutes, and I think it will be better as its own video. What do you think? Um, so, yeah, guys, this is officially the first episode of Wolong Fallen Dynasty. I hope you enjoyed it. I'm going to continue my Hogwarts Legacy playthrough, and my Wolong Fallen Dynasty will go alongside it. Um... So yeah, I'll have both of those running. I expect to finish Hogwarts quite soon. And then maybe I will be doing two Wolong videos a day. But in the meantime, it'll be one Hogwarts, one Wolong. So I hope you enjoyed it. If you enjoyed, please leave a like on the video. It really helps me know that people are enjoying what I'm playing. And if you want to see more of my content, you can subscribe to the channel for notifications when I upload. And as always, I'm Drastic Scuba, and I hope to see you in the next one. Bye-bye for now.